If you have ever taken part in the Riverbank Run, you have definitely seen him. Rob Waldheis carries an American flag and wears a brightly colored tutu. I caught up with him ahead of this weekend's race to talk about his journey. So you moved back to Grand Rapids, and the first race that you did was Riverbank Run. Yeah, 2015 was my first run okay. ever. So I was so amazed by the organization of it all and just all the different groups that were out here. So Yeah, and then you just kept doing it year after year. What did you love about it? I love the community aspect of it. Uh, they really got involved with a lot of the runners and the different uh, running groups and, you know, set out the training plans and kind of accountability and that sort of thing. And that really, being part of that community is what really drew me to uh, different aspects of the Riverbank Run. Yeah. yeah, and then you're a road warrior. Correct, yeah. I didn't get in my first year. Uh, I had a little polishing to do yet. So, uh, But the second year that I applied, I was uh, accepted in, and it was a huge honor uh, just to be trained by some coaches and really get some good instruction uh, from them in regards to me being a better, more efficient runner. Yeah. And also the the community aspect of it and just engaging more with community and the community partners that we had and just uh, making it the race a more rich experience. And we should mention that you don't just sort of blend into the crowd as we can see today <laughs> even when you're running yeah. you are known as tutu man absolutely how'd so, that start so the tutu was just one day i was at a race and i saw some people that were dressed up and they were having so much fun and everybody else was taking it so darn seriously and i said i want to have some fun but in a little bit of serious but you know i just want to have some fun and make some people laugh and smile because i went home and i remembered them from the whole race and I said you know what I just want to bring some laughs and smiles to people so uh, started going through some costume things and uh, the tutu is just an easy <laughs> you can put it on anything it matches with a lot of stuff and I always uh, my go-to is a uh, red white and blue uh, I always try to carry the flag and uh, represent America a little bit that way because even when you're running 15 and a half miles sure. you still want to spread some joy absolutely yeah. it takes your mind off of those uh, <laughs> points that uh, kind of stink you know when you're going up those hills and, yes. and you see some guy in a tutu blow past you you say oh man <laughs> tutu man just passed me yeah you know that is just like such a good attitude to have in life but but your life hasn't been all just happy Happiness and, and, and joyful, and that really is a reminder to yourself too. It is. It is. It's. Uh, it's a reminder to me to uh, to not let my past, I guess, define where I'm going in the future. Uh, you know, I'm uh, this year. I'm 11 years sober, and it's been a journey. And it, but it's been worth every single step of that. And running, and the support that I've had from the running community along that sobriety journey has been priceless to me since I've been here.